First impressions matter, but sometimes St. Joseph struggles to put its best foot forward. News Press Now's Greg Kozel tells us about a program that seeks to increase the city's wow factor. A visitor might get an impression of faded glory when entering St. Joseph through corridors on the north end, south side, and downtown. If you go through those areas, these are areas of town that, that do need some help. You know, St. Joe Avenue uh, at one time was vibrant and amazing and full, it still has great architecture. You can still see what once was there. and so. Giving it a bit of a boost, I think, will will do some great things. St. Joseph's historic planner and other community leaders are trying to restore the shine to some parts of town. Their tool is not a clean solution, but $2 million in funding from the American Rescue Plan Act. So it's a pretty all-inclusive plan, and it does run from the south end on King Hill Avenue to the north end on St. Joseph Avenue. Um, so we're just thrilled that we got the grant. We're eager to get started. The city will use the funding to create the River Bluff Gateway Project that makes improvements to buildings, sidewalks, and streetscapes in four specific areas. King Hill on the south side, St. Joseph Avenue on the north end, 6th Street near downtown, and parts of downtown itself. The goal is to focus improvements on areas that serve as a gateway into St. Joseph, especially with the development of a bike trail network. And so we really wanted to make sure that St. Joe had the opportunity to put its best foot forward, if you will. The hope is that a targeted approach serves as a catalyst to improve surrounding neighborhoods. And so we're really hoping that um, by reaching into these neighborhoods and doing some, some very kind of, again, targeted and strategic projects, that will will inculcate this kind of idea of pride of place and pride of, of where you are. For News Press Now, this is Greg Kozel.